A young boy will die if his father loses a fight. Where is he? Where are you hiding, nice? Unable to pay for his son's chemotherapy, retired boxer Isaiah Ice Jackson will fight again. Unfortunately for him, he will face off against the most dangerous man on earth, Kurt the Mountain Backstrom. Are you crazy? What the hell is this, some kind of publicity stunt? It's not. If Jackson wins, he will earn enough to save his son. If Backstrom wins, young Max could die. Kid, get out of here. Don't you dare talk to him. Kid, tell me. What do you think you're doing? Don't get in my way, old man. Don't talk to the boy. That's off limits. That's off limits! Is that the kind of man you are? Stand up and face me. Tell me, kid. Don't. Tell me, kid. You really have cancer? Ice. It's just crazy mind games. It's not a game, man! Just realize what you've done. Condemned your boy to a goddamn death sentence. My dad could keep your boy! Max. 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 Let him come. It's okay. Yeah, but he won't be. Leave. Fight. I fight men, not boys. Leave. I won't lose this fight just so you can save me. That's on you. What are you doing? Nothing. Show me. What is this? I'm leaving my mark. You're leaving your mark? Yeah, leaving my mark. Just like you said. <laughs> it's a figure of speech, Max. It doesn't mean you gotta put your hands all over the place. Looks like it won't come off. Good. Good? Yeah, good. Because I don't want people to forget. Forget what? Me. Hey, look at me. Look at me. It's not going to happen, Max. Your old man's going to win. Promise, Dad? You leave your mark by living, by going forward, no matter what. No matter what? No matter what. One day I'm going to be a fighter. <laughs> no way. Uh-uh. Listen, you can be a, you could be an accountant, a lawyer, a doctor, a teacher, anything but this. We'll see. We'll see? Yeah, we'll see. Well, you're gonna have to get through me first. <laughs> gotcha. Isaiah Ice Jackson retired from boxing five years ago when his wife died in childbirth. While his record has been inconsistent, his longtime coach, Eddie Fitzgerald, maintains that Jackson has what it takes to go all the way. Kurt the Mountain Backstrom is heavily praised as one of the greatest fighters of all time. The undefeated champion has ended the career of three of his last five opponents. One of them is still confined to a wheelchair.
What are you doing here? I love you, Dad. Ice. What's going on? Where's my son? Is he in there? Wait. Oh, calm down. Who's your son? Max Jackson. Sir, can we talk? Calm, calm down. Can we Max. talk? Max, sir, can you hear me? Sir, sir. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? He's, he's can still you, with us. Where is my son? I need you to be calm. I need you to be calm. So that's it, huh? Can I do anything? No. It's all taken care of. It's not too late. Don't. Ice. We've still got it's time. Over. Just consider Listen. the. Listen. I'll see you at the funeral. February eleventh, nineteen ninety. I remember it like it was yesterday. That day, the unthinkable happened. It was supposed to be a quick payday. The odds were 42 to 1. Tyson had won 37 matches in a row. He'd never been knocked down, ever. Buster Douglas was just a sitting duck. Hey, what are we about to see? Another 90-second annihilation of an ill-prepared opponent? Well, in the important game of expectations, this fight is over before it begins or soon thereafter. Tyson knocked him out in the eighth round. And there's a right hand uppercut and down goes Douglas. Saved by the bell. Still one, let's see what Doug can do. Came back fighting in the night. And the crowd here is greeting it by and large with stony silence. Cut again and misses. Douglas comes back with a left and a right. Tyson is wobbling. Tyson needs the ropes. And then in the tenth. him how he won that fight. He told them he made a promise to his mother that he would knock Mike Tyson out. I don't care about the fight fits. 
It was never about that. She died before the fight. Douglas could have died on that canvas along with his mother, but he decided to stand up and start living for her. You made the kid a problem. It's over, Vince. Drop it. Pick up the damn towel. grades are catastrophic, you're disorganized, you're hyperactive. This is you. This is what you want. But you will not get there because you can't focus. <laughs> 